we just finished a mentoring session, uh, Rachel and I, uh, from Puddleicious, and we're going to talk about magical mentoring moments. So Rachel, hi Rachel, would you just kindly introduce yourself and just tell us a bit more about your business first of all? Hi Paul, thank you. Yes, uh, my name's Rachel Ratcliffe. Um, my, my business is Puddleicious. I'm a Lancashire-based company uh, and I specialise in making the most delicious puddings, cakes and sweet treats. Fantastic. And I can absolutely 100% vouch for the quality of your cakes after trying the crumbles that you uh, you kindly sent us. They were absolutely amazing. Um, so just this is about mentoring again. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about what experience you've got from mentoring, being mentored or mentoring other people? Yeah, of course. Um, so I've never actually mentored anybody myself, um, but I previously have experience of working with a mentor before yourself as well. Um, in my previous career, I was a graduate fast tracker in Her Majesty's Prison Service. So uh, in just two years of joining the service um, and working the landings, I became a trainee operational governor. And um, so as you can imagine, for it was a steep long learning curve, especially being a young woman in a very male dominated environment. Um, it, it was a huge, a huge learning curve. I had to learn an awful lot in a very short space of time in quite unusual um environment really sure. so I had a mentor in the service at that point and um, it was a very job specific mentor um, program but it worked brilliantly and um, I think the reason it was so successful is my, my mentor that I was assigned he knew lots of experience and if he didn't know the answer he knew he always knew somebody who did sure. but yeah. he never looked down on me for not coming through the ranks he never looked down on me for being inexperienced uh, he never patronized me once um, and, and he never, no question was ever ridiculed. Um, and I'd laugh sometimes, I'd ask a question and it, when he'd give me the answer, it was so obvious, I'd laugh. And he'd laugh with me, but never at me, never made me feel foolish. Um, it was really down to earth and we got on with each other really well, which I think makes a big difference as well. It was, you know, it felt like I was meeting with a friend as opposed to somebody that was very formal. And <clears throat> and we, we tended to, soon we soon fell into the pattern where we'd meet over coffee rather than a very formalized meeting so it worked really well and um, now obviously sort of fast forward into my catering career and uh, my catering business and um, really lucky through to start working with with yourself paul i'm also working with a, a group which is funded through boost which is a weekly um, support group which is it, it's, it's like a mentor process as well because it's great we get to bounce ideas around and support each other that way and um, and then obviously now I'm working with you. Do you want me to talk about yourself and my experience with you, Paul, yet? No, no that's fine. That's fine. Thanks, Rachel. It's more about, about your um, your mentoring experience. It's great. Quite a lot of mentoring experience as well. Very positive experiences as well, by the sounds of it. Very. Yes, yes. absolutely. We're talking yeah. today about magical mentoring moments. So what we mean by that is those light bulb moments. We call them light bulb moments in mentoring and coaching. And, and it's that moment of clarity that you get um, when through the mentoring conversation that that time when you, you get focused on the future and you can start to make some key pivotal decisions in your business so have you got a, a specific example of a light bulb moment for you that you can share with us uh, yes absolutely so believe it or not it was actually during our first session um, and um, completely hit a, a light bulb moment and I think that's when I knew that I found the right mentor for me um, which <laughs> Um, so we were discussing ways for me to get a range of my products out there um, to customers and some of the challenges I had come across so far. Um, and you, you made a, a specific suggestion, a, a great idea, but something that had never even crossed my mind. And it literally poof, blew my mind completely. Um, and it, it's just, it was a completely alternative way for me to work, but with incredible potential. Um, and I think I became probably a little bit incoherent <laughs> because I was like, oh, wow, gosh, yeah. Oh, oh it was just such a, a, a huge thing. And um, the potential, but that night I didn't sleep. And most of that week, cause I kept waking up and I'd be thinking about all these different things um, and different. And then it's been great because that light bulb moment where it was like, oh, wow, even if the actual, process we talked about doesn't come to fruition it just made me look at things in a totally different way um, and we've worked on that since and we're breaking it down now into bite-sized pieces so I'm back to sleeping again now which oh, is really good, good. 
um, but yeah, so that was uh, that was my my light bulb moment there in our first session. It was just like wow, just looking at things totally different. That's it, and that's brilliant. Just to hear that 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 moment, that light bulb moment, and the impact it's had on you. Yeah. And that positivity and that that new way of thinking is fantastic, and that's exactly what mentoring is about. Yeah. So what do you do with that light bulb moment, that positivity now in your business? How will that help you go forward? Oh, it definitely helped me go forward and um, help me focus where what the direction I want to go in and um, I kind of I'd rebranded earlier this year anyway because I knew I wanted to change direction but I was still sort of making my mind up as to really which way I wanted to go but through that it's really made me focus and I'm very clear now on where I want to go and where I want to be at the end of it and um, and obviously with the work we're still doing together is helping me get there in bite-sized pieces but it's keeping me focused and keeping me energized and enthusiastic that's amazing what a great example of mentoring and how that can help and i think the important thing about mentoring is that you know that that idea sharing and yeah. that team it's the team approach isn't it you know mentoring very much a team approach and that's what i really enjoy about mentoring and working with you as well and particularly being a food business my background yeah. Uh, I'm really enjoying working with you. So thank you very much. My pleasure. Thank you. Thank you very much, Rachel. <laughs>